This video is going to demonstrate proper technique for riding a horse over a jump. Posture, contact, confidence, and developing an eye for the jump are key factors in making riding enjoyable and successful. I started riding when I was eight years old. I was trained in a hunter jumper, but I've gained experience in dressage and eventing as well. Although jumping has its difficulties such as finding the correct spots, it's something I enjoy doing and am passionate about. Both horse and rider should do a few laps of walking, trotting, and cantering to warm up. Ride in each direction to maintain flexibility. Make sure the horse is comfortable seeing the jump by riding near it. Warming up ensures that the horse is listening to the rider on flat before tackling any jumps. This position is called two point. It helps ensure that the rider's leg is secure against the horse during takeoff and landing. The upper body lifts off the horse's back to relieve weight and the hands reach up the neck so as not to pull on the bit in the horse's mouth. The key is to sink your weight into your heels and use your upper body muscles to hold the position over the jump. Your hands should not actually rest on the horse's neck. The rider usually goes into this position just as the horse prepares for takeoff and ends moments after landing. It is best to start with a low jump that is not scary. This will be more appealing for the horse. Approach the jump at a trot with confidence just a few meters away. If the horse refuses, that's okay. Make a circle and approach the jump again. The horse can sense how you feel, so it is important to be confident the second time around. Keep your head up and look where you want to go. Looking down at the jump can shift your weight to be unbalanced. Now approach the cross rail at a canter from further away. Count the strides when nearing the jump in a 1-2, one, 1-2 two, one, two rhythm. Having contact through your arms and seat can help you feel whether or not the horse will leave out a stride or add one in. If you feel your strides are off, use your arms to squeeze on the reins and hold back the horse, or use your legs to urge him on. Once you have practiced two-point in counting your strides, raise the jump to a vertical. It is important to have a good foundation at the lower level before moving up. Make sure to let the horse see that the jump looks different and is comfortable with it. Practicing over the new jump will test posture, confidence, in your eye. Riding over the jumps with proper technique is for safety. Although it's an exhilarating experience, if done incorrectly, can result in injuries to both you and your horse. Being safe ensures fun and success in your future as an equestrian. Music